Howdy! I'm Michaela Flynn. I am a biochemistry and genetics major here at Texas A&M. Today I'll be taking you on a tour of the biochemistry and biophysics department along with our new NMR facility. We've got three NMR instruments in this room. This particular one behind me is a 600 megahertz dual solid liquid NMR instrument. And on the other side of the camera we have two NMR instruments, but we're not showing you those today. Eventually, all of these will be moved over to the new NMR facility, which we're headed over to soon. Here we are inside the biochemistry and biophysics department. This is our lovely first floor atrium, and to this side is one of our large lecture halls, where we host very many interesting seminars throughout the year. So now we are in the NMR facility in one of the labs on the second floor, and we're actually going to do a quick walkthrough so that you can see two of them. Let's go. lecture halls where most of our first year graduate students take a lot of their classes. We'll take a quick walk through Dr. Hayes Rise Lab. Let's go. the protein chemistry lab, one of our fee-for-service labs where we do a lot of proteomics work, including amino acid sequencing and mass spec. Behind me, I've actually got two of the mass specs that we use. And on the other side of the camera, which I think we'll get to see later, we've got some robots that do some work. Now that you've seen BioBio Bio in the NMR facility, we trekked over to main campus to give you a little bonus tour. We are standing in front of the Interdisciplinary Life Sciences Building, which houses a few of our other professors, including Dr. Jim Sacatini. And we're gonna go check out his lab right now. Let's go. Here's a quick peek at Dr. Jim Sacatini's actual wet lab, where they do everything from protein purification to crystallography. And actually, we'll get a chance to look at the crystallography lab in just a second. Here's a quick peek inside the ILSB building. Check out the architecture of this atrium. Here we are in Dr. Sacchini's crystallography room where he's two of his x-ray department. We are now in Dr. Jim Sacchini's lab standing next to one of their sci-bio robots which they use for a multitude of things including, as you can see right now, cherry picking and fluorescence plate reading. 